Good morning, everybody. This is Sunday, April the 5th. Um, our announcements might be a little bit long, and you'll notice that this is not live. This is record, recorded, uh, so I'm going to do my best to, to get everything in and not forget anything. So I thought maybe this would be the best way to do that. Uh, first of all, most of these announcements are going to be running through the slides, so if you miss something, uh, you can pause the video and go back and look at it, and um, once, it, once it's up, uh, after we've already... Um, after we've already recorded it. So go back through the week, look through those slides that are scrolling through, and, uh, and hopefully you can find some more information. Um, but we want to keep connected with you. Um, this is becoming more and more important. Um, so if you have not been getting emails from the church um, and you would like to do that, you can simply send an email to Tulip Church of God. That's one word, no caps, Tulip Church of God at gmail.com. And just request to be added, and we will put you on the list uh, so that you can get emails from that point. If you would like to get texts, uh, we we do have a process where we send texts to uh, to everybody. Um, if you want to get those text updates, text the at symbol at 27D63. At 27D63. Text that to the number 81010 and you will be added to that to that list. Um, again, a lot of times our emails and texts are, are duplicates of each other, but if you don't want to miss anything, it's a great way to do it. Also, just get in the habit of checking the website, tulipchurchofgod.org, and our YouTube channel. Uh, I try to put updates and announcements and prayers and those kind of things on there several times a week. Um, we sometimes link all of those things to Facebook, uh, but not always. So just kind of get in the habit of, of looking around and, and finding us. Um, next Sunday. Next Sunday is Easter. Uh, we've been making some plans. Of course, as always, plans uh, sometimes change, and, and they may continue to change. But at this point in time, um, after talking with our team, we've decided that we would like to do a sunrise service. Um, so we've chosen to do a drive-in sunrise service. Our parking lot has plenty of room, um, so uh, we're going to start that at 7 in the morning. So if you want to be a part of a sunrise service, come uh, just drive in 7 o'clock. Uh, we'll have our sound system set up under the carport. Please don't leave your cars. Uh, I know that'll be tempting. Um, try to leave that space in between um, as, uh, as has been recommended. We'd, we'd love to see you here but your safety is our primary concern. Um, so, uh, so just make sure that you observe um, those safety procedures. Just, just stay in your car, uh, roll down your window. We'll, we'll turn it up loud enough that our neighbors can, uh, can hear what's going on. Um, but, uh, but hopefully you'll, um, and, and you'll be able to hear what's going on. Um, we do not have plans at this point in time to broadcast that service. If that changes, we'll let you know. Um, but again, that's 7 o'clock next Sunday morning. Uh, just come in and, uh, and plan on worshiping with us at that time. Also then, during our normal service, we plan on celebrating communion together. Um, and so if, uh, if you have juice or bread, and uh, juice and bread at home, that certainly will do. Um, uh, or, or, you know, whatever, um, whatever it is that you, you feel like you can use to participate in that. If you do not have that, we're prepared to deliver a communion care package to you. Um, or maybe if you're attending the sunrise service, um, we, we, you know, we'll have some available then and you can simply, uh, uh, flag us down somehow and we'll get you that care package that has uh, some juice and some bread in it. Um, and then, um, uh, or if you're not coming to that but you still need um, that care package, if you'll just contact me, my phone number is 812-381-4176, and you can text me or you can call me, um, and if you tell us how many will be participating in your home, we'll try to make sure that we get that package to you in one way or another. Finally, um, we we miss seeing your faces. I miss seeing you around. Um, and so we thought that Easter would be a great week to kind of do something a little bit different for our greeting. Um, so, so this week we want you to send an Easter greeting to your church family. So through an app uh, or, or a website that's called Flipgrid, 
F L I P G R I D. Um, you can go to you can pull up the app on your phone or you can go to to the website. Um, just Flipgrid and you can pull it up. Uh, you can record a 15 second or less greeting to the church. Um, so, like I said, if you go to Flipgrid, uh, just pull it up. It'll ask you for an access code, and that access code is 7A. One five B D E F seven A one five B D E F. It'll take you to a page. Um, Laura Helms has created that, so it might have her name on it. But you can record um, a fifteen second greeting. Um, or if you look below this video in the descriptions, um, we'll have a link directly to that Easter greeting page, and you can go that way. So just have some fun. Be creative. And, uh, and send your greeting to the church. I think those are most of the announcements at this time. Um, so if there's other things, like I said, just keep checking back and, uh, and we will, we'll make sure to, to try to keep you updated. Thanks. Have a blessed morning.